there's always, you know, pressures coming off a championship season. Um, I think the main thing too is, I mean, we lost five key players and a lot of schools know that. Uh, I think the thing that we've known now that we've seen some players step up last spring uh, into new roles. We've had a young core uh, a transfer and, you know, some freshmen that have really contributed greatly in the preseason. Um, you know, I still definitely see us as, a, as an underdog. You know, I, I think there's a couple teams that, you know, are pretty loaded of talent in the A-10 right now. Um, you know, but like last season, you know, you had a chip on your shoulder. Uh, that's the identity we're still trying to create for our kids is we haven't really proven anything yet. It's a whole new season. Uh, we can't dwell on our past now, um, but it's been great to see the attitude of the girls, their commitment and training. Uh, it's exactly where we uh, left off last season. Uh, I think it's been really good. We had some big shoes to fill, I think. Like, we had five starters leave, so our freshmen have to step it up and push the starters. And the freshmen that came in look really good, and they are pushing everyone, which is what we need. You know, I mean, again, losing a couple special players, um, and Kristen and Danny in the attack, um, you know, will affect us. Uh, but, you know, having Maddie and Macy back, you know, I think they're as, as good as any tandem in the country right now. Um, but the greatest thing is I think we have more depth than we had last season. Um, you know, our sixth, seventh, eighth attacker right now are, are, are contributing in training and contributing in these scrimmages. Um, so I think we could, we could have as dynamic of an attack as we had last season, and, and that's what we're really hoping for. Well, we know that we were on the top last year fall like at the end of it but still that mentality where we need to prove ourselves each year it's never like given to us which is important for our mindset I think if we just act like we or we have our mindset thinking oh we can't be walked all over again like we did before I think we'll come out on top again just really strong-minded and never give up type of mentality yeah we know it's not gonna be easy we know if we have targets on our back but we're looking forward to it, forward to it. I mean we no pressure is going to be there, but we're just going to take it in stride and we're going to do great this season. Yeah, well, you know, I mean, you want to play against these high, high-level teams because um, one of the great experiences when you get to tournament time is you have to know how to play in big games. Um, and for some of these young kids, this is going to be the biggest game they've ever played in their life. Uh, Syracuse, obviously, in the ACC, you know, high-quality side. Um, but it, it, it's great because I love when our team plays against awesome teams. Uh, they step up, you know, they outperform their abilities that they've shown. Um, and that's what I'm anticipating Thursday night.